What is pollution? If there are substances or a substance in the environment that is toxic and should not be there, there is pollution. Pollution include pollutants or substances that are harmful to plants, animal, and human health. Pollution is present when something harmful enters the environment faster than it can be dispersed. Pollution is a global problem. There are hundreds of different types of pollutants. The major types of pollution are air pollution and water pollution. Air pollution is visible. Air pollution or atmospheric pollution occurs when too many harmful particulates, chemicals and gases build up in the atmosphere. Common air pollutants caused by human activity include sulfur dioxide, nitrogen oxide, CFC and carbon dioxide. Smoke and ozone in the lower atmosphere are the result of hydrocarbons and nitrogen oxide reacting to sunlight. A person can see dark smoke pour from the exhaust pipes of large trucks or factories for example. Polluted air can be dangerous even if the pollutants are invisible. It can make people's eyes burn and make them difficulty breathing. Pollutants are bad for our environment. Water pollution includes the contaminations of rivers, lakes, sea and oceans. Water pollution occurs when pollutants build up in the water faster than we can get rid of them. Some polluted water looks moody, smells bad and has garbage floating in it. Some polluted water looks clean but is filled with harmful chemicals you can see or smell. Polluted water is unsafe for drinking and swimming. Some people who drink polluted water are exposed to hazardous chemicals that may make them sick years later. Others consume bacteria and other tiny aquatic organisms that causes disease. Most cases of water pollution today are the results of human activity. Southeast Asia is a hot spot for ambient air pollution or pollution that people are exposed to outside their homes. According to the most recent World Air Quality Report 2020, 37 of the world's top of 40 most polluted cities are in Southeast Asia. Air pollution is a health problem in the region and it is the third leading cause of premature mortality. The Southeast Asian haze is a recurring transboundary air pollution issue caused by fires. Haze events in which air quality reaches dangerous level due to high quantities of airborne particulate matter from burning biomass have had negative health, environmental and economic consequences in various Southeast Asian nations. The problem, which is mostly caused by slash and burn land removal, flares up to variable degree throughout each dry season and is normally severe between July and October, as well as during El Nino episodes. Next, industrial scale slash and burn operation to clear land for agricultural reasons are the major cause of the haze, notably in the region palm oil and palm wood industry. Land is burned because it less expensive and faster than cutting and clearing with excavator or other machines. Fire ignited for this reason can also quickly spread and cause forest fire, exacerbating the situation. The high percentage of peat in soil contribute in the density and high sulfur content of the haze. Sources have been identified as fire in Indonesia, especially South Sumatra and Riau in Sumatra and Kalimantan in Borneo and to a lesser extent in Malaysia and Thailand. The haze has a significant influence on air quality in Indonesia, Malaysia, Singapore and Brunei Darussalam on a regular basis to a lesser extent and it's exceptionally bad years. It also affects the Philippines, Thailand, Vietnam, Cambodia and nations beyond the area. The majority of haze episodes have been caused by smoke from the pit and land fire in Sumatra and the Kalimantan portion of Borneo Island. Poor accountability and transparency of Indonesia agricultural firms 
as well as a lack of political economic incentive to hold her companies accountable have been recognized as major imp- impediments to resolving their problem. Undisturbed humid tropical woods are through the exceptionally resistant to fire with fires occurring only in the extremely dry seasons. Water pollution is one of the main environmental issues that we are facing as more than 70% of the Earth's surface is water covered. There are two types of water pollution. First, organic pollution and second is chemical pollution generated by human, animal drug, household product, heavy metal, acid, and hydrocarbon used in industry. And so surprisingly, human activity is primarily responsible for water pollution even if natural phenomena such as landslide and flood can also contribute to degrade the water quality. As in the video, the river was polluted due to chemical waste discharge activity from irresponsible factories. This has resulted in polluted, dirty rivers and dead fish. A huge amount of the industrial waste is drained in the fresh water, which then flow into canal, river, and eventually in the sea. Water pollution can affect the environment and human health. Effects on human health is materials dumped in the river will reduce the oxygen content in the air. Humans can also get serious illness or health problems if polluted or use polluted air. Effects on water quality is toxic sub- substance release will affect the food cycle by affecting and poisoning living things in rivers and lakes such as uh, weeds, birds, fish and other living things. Next is reducing the soft oxygen content process produced by industry, especially the food processing industry are usually rich in inorganic nutrients such as nitrogen, phosphorus, and potassium. Effect of air pollution in Southeast ASEAN is that has polluted the air and reduced visibility over the past in September 2015. In several locations in our country, is a long-standing problem facing Malaysia and neighboring countries. Many suffer from the irritating effects of fine dust particles on the nose, throat, skin, and eyes. Asthma patients have a higher risk, while children, infants, and the elderly are the group most vulnerable to the effects of haze. Schools in Kuching and Kota Samarahan, Sarawak have been ordered closed since Thursday as air pollution index. Readings have reached 200. This involves 184808 students in 463 primary and secondary schools. Early reports said the what spread has increased in 1997 cost and estimate loss of US 9 billion RM uh, to the Southeast ASEAN region due to disruption to air travel, increased healthcare spending, and other haze, haze related losses. Some ideas and suggestions to be implemented or used to prevent the source of air, hazing preventing and water pollution. His pollution is the one of air pollution in major category of pollutions that cause so many bad effects and also some research has stated that every year air pollution kills 8.9 million people worldwide. That indicates that somebody dies from air pollution every 4 seconds somewhere on the planet. More than 99% from poor indoor air quality and nearly 90% of deaths from pollution exports occur in low and middle income countries where the sense fuel combustion for cooking heating is a major health concern.
optimization of factory operation which means make the system more efficient more efficient operation minimize the volume of pollution produced by a factory industries can optimize various aspects of their operation to save energy lowering carbon output of facility using motorcycle and car that can cause haze with the smoke emission from the vehicle itself for this problem there are few recommendations which is people should be encouraged to switch from motor vehicles to active transportation for example cycling, walking or use public electronic transport such as electronic system or ETS or another electronic transport. In this way, not only can reduce haze in the air but also can reduce people from getting sick and die from this kind. Next is water pollution. Water is amongst the most essential resources on the planet and that we can always do our role to keep clean. Simple change such as using organic cleaning agents in your home rather than harmful ones and cultivation more flowers and plants in your garden can have a significant impact. Water pollution also same as air pollution. It is just not from factories but also from human the way or the suggestions to reduce or prevent the water pollution is from home. Eateries, factories should retain all facts and lubricants away from the sink. Commonly serve all fat and stains should not be floated down the dishwasher. The role of government also important, which is to help ensure a better health environment for future generation run. The government must understand the causes such as pollution reductions. The pollution itself is action. Really need to be worried and need to take an action to prevent the pollution getting worse. So far, the air pollution in Indonesia about the transboundary air pollution that caused by fire. This air pollution gives the negative impact to the living such as negative health. The fire caused by burn operation to clear land for agriculture because of the using this method are less expensive and faster than cutting and clearing with excavator or machine. This issue is mostly coming from South Sumatra and Riau in Sumatra, Indonesia. Indonesia really need to take an action about how to clear the land in future for agricultural purpose using the new and safe way to reduce the air pollution. Other than that, the water pollution in Southeast Asia also need to be worried because there is the living underwater and we need to, to save our marine ecosystem for future. The issue when the factory in Bukit Keteri, which is 5 km from the river that was found to have polluted, the water of Sungai Ngulang that causing hundreds of fish die. These Sungai Ngulang are very important to the residents there because they go fishing at this river. Also, the water from this river are used for irrigating paddy field in Perlis. The Environmental Quality Act 1974 needed to be strictly enforced with appropriate punishment to the factory imposed on those responsible. The pollution in Southeast Asia need to urge the action. One of the action is transnational collaboration in the region is a must. The air pollution is not the local pollution because the air is no border. The air pollution can only be solved either by the regional cooperation or global environment laws which, which do not yet exist. In a dynamic region covering a huge geographical area uh, such as Southeast Asia, such issue poses a major obstacle to resolving the multitude of challenges relating to transboundary air pollution. Population growth, rapid urbanization and climate change are drivers of water pollution and flooding in Southeast Asia. There are several ways to raise the profile of water security activities as a countermeasure to this pollution. The Southeast Asian government are aware of the intersecting challenges of water security and disaster governance. Implementing the initiative will help ensure the collective effort to secure and reduce the air pollution, also water pollution in Southeast Asian.